So we're going to do a quick technique for how to put in eye drops and eye ointment with a horse. So I'm just first cleaning up Prima's face. She had a little bit of fly mask funk and she gets very runny eyes. And so she's one that I treat her eyes regularly. And um, she also had an eye ulcer, which is, it's a lot of treatment. It's like every four hours, they need something in their eyes. So I'm just gonna show an easy way to, this is clear eyes, which is just a saline solution. And you can use human saline solution, but this is just gonna flush the eye. So when you go to put anything in the eye, <laughs> she knows, you wanna stand here with their head over your shoulder. And that way you can reach up with one hand and kind of pry the eye open while you flush it with the bottle. I know, good girl. I'm gonna do the same thing on this side. It's a little more awkward because I have to put the drops in with my left hand. But I'm just going to kind of hold the eyelids up and down. And then I don't have to get the bottle near the eye. I can just get above it and flush the eye. I know, it's a big mess. Good girl. So, and eye issues, if you see two different eyes, or like she gets a little bit of this swelling here. The flies bother her eyes quite a bit. Um, weeping eyes, one swollen eye, the eye kind of closed. Any eye issues um, can become pretty serious pretty fast. So learning how to just flush the eye with saline or use, you can keep um, an antibiotic ointment on hand like that's Neosporin for horses. You can get it from your vet. This is just an artificial tears ointment, but the Neosporin looks the same, or the eye ointment, antibiotic eye ointment looks the same. So what you wanna be careful with when you're using eye ointment is that you don't poke them in the eye because you certainly don't wanna get an ulcer on top of any other eye irritation or a scratch. So I'm gonna do that the same way. I'm gonna just put her chin over my shoulder and then, should I turn her sideways? Can you see where I'm, how I'm doing the eye? I'll turn her a little bit. I don't know if my head's in the way. But here I'm gonna keep the eye ointment coming in from the top, so even if she gets fussy, there we go. I can sort of drop it in. I can squeeze it above the eye and let it fall in where this tip is well away from the eye. So of course she ruined my shot. She was like, <laughs> not gonna cooperate. So I'll try this side. So I'm gonna put it way up here and squirt it down into the eye, just like that. And then let her close. And usually if they really need the eye ointment, they start to really enjoy it and they get less and less fussy. It's the first couple times, they don't really like the flushing of the eye, but the first couple times you add ointment, it really soothes the eyes, and so they start to be less and less fussy about that. But this is a great position for treating eyes, especially if you're by yourself and you have to do it a whole bunch, because getting right in here, you've got two hands to work with, so you can open the eye and put your drops in, and you're kind of controlling the head from here and you can even grab the lead rope down here.